Hello. How is everybody doing? Orc, Marcus, hi. Uh, hello, quick, no one's here yet. <laughs> uh, no, sorry. I will load into Outer Wilds, though. Yeah, so I've I finished the game, um, which was phenomenal, and I will sing praises about it for years to come. Uh, I'm sounds a little sarcastic there, but I but that is serious. Um, I did really love this game, um, but there's a little bit of endgame content that I didn't get to during the last stream. Um, so my plan for today is to just run through some of the endings that. Uh, I didn't see it. So actually, you know what? Let's actually go back down because I'm gonna I'm gonna have to wait so that we can get into the uh, into the project, the Ashtrim project. So we're gonna sit by the campfire. You're here, you're ready for it? I don't know. I just like uh just 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 not not my thing. At least not on stream now. I'm, I'm. It makes me uncomfortable. Not, not my deal. I'll let this go for a couple of minutes. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, that'd be nice, Marcus. <laughs> I don't know if I could make it any more clear. <laughs> You can ask other people, that's fine. But how are you guys doing? Oh my god, I got my second shot yesterday, or two days ago, for the COVID shot. I got Moderna. And, um, holy shit was I kicked on my ass. Oh my god. I had, like... After the shot, I went over to a friend's place, watched a movie, um, and then um, after I got home, I was, like, feeling pretty groggy, my arm hurt, but, like, pretty normal stuff, you know. Um, uh, and then I went to bed early because I was just feeling off, and, like, an hour or two later, I woke up. And I had chills, like cold sweats, nausea, a really bad headache, and I just like woke up and I was just like, oh god, what? And I like, I was, it was crazy how terrible I felt. Um, I couldn't, I couldn't believe how bad. <laughs> How bad I was but I mean totally worth it and I'm, I'm better now but it, it took like a good amount of time let's see where's the Sun there it is past fire versus uh, Moderna gang war incoming yours is in two weeks to see how you handle it how was the first one for you orc was it like um, pretty manageable because the first one I felt off enough that I knew the second one was gonna suck didn't affect you at all then you'll probably be fine So there's a couple of endings here. Ooh. The first one that we're gonna go for. There was one that just sounds funny. Where we go into 
the Pro Ashtun Project. And I looked up a little guide for a couple of these, so... I don't, I don't think they're gonna take that long, honestly. So I'm not really sure what my plan is after this. I don't know if it's just gonna be a short stream or if I'm gonna switch to a different game. Come on, another planet. Hurry up. There it is. It's coming along. I got a game queued up. I mean, I've been... My intention was to play Lost Ember. I, I picked that up a few months ago. And I was like, whenever I finish Outer Wilds, I'm gonna play that and then I'm gonna play Subnautica. And now it's like, Subnautica launches on Friday and I won't even have time to play Lost Ember in between the two. So I was like, I guess I could start that, but then I'm gonna be taking a break from it or I have to push back Subnautica. I guess I could always do like Hades or something. I think I was just kind of itching to get back to streaming after being dead for so many days. Oh, so cool. That doesn't get old. All right. Oh, it's a four hour game. Oh, then I could probably do it in one sitting or maybe two sittings because I don't stream for long hours at a time. Oh, that's very interesting. The other thing I was thinking is it'd be cool if we both played it in a relatively short amount of time because we'll uh, then be able to talk about it. Come on, come on. There we go. Yeah, you're finishing it on Sunday. I yeah. Makes sense. Oh, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Thanks for the lurk. Enjoy your lurk. Oh, there it is. Send me back. All right. So here we got one. Let's see. Oh, sick. I was hoping our ship would still be out here, but I assumed that the sand would take it away. So, one of the endings that I looked up that sounds just, like, super funny is, uh, you take the core out of the sun, or out, out of the project, and then you just, just book it. Just, just leave the whole solar system. And just get really far away. I don't know what happens at the end of any of these. I looked up what you had to do to get to the endings, but I don't know what happens. There we go. Now we can actually, like, watch some stuff as we back up. Abort autopilot. Fuck that. We're not going back. What's this autopilot doing? It doesn't even know. Oh, did we go too far? I think we went too far. Let's go back a little bit. I don't want stuff to be like completely out of view. Because then it just like de renders. <laughs> the music's dope though. Man, 
right now, I'm just confused. Oh, wait, I just saw it. Oh, it's just like not rendering in for some reason. Cause like I saw it and it was pretty big. Yeah. Slow down. We're going real fast. even back up a little more. And we'll see. Well, we're just goofing off right now. I don't know how far the supernova goes. I think this is far enough because we're like behind all of the planets. But now we wait. Now we chill. can't be that much time. I remember the last time that we went like outside the solar system try fo following the uh, the probe and it just kept going and I got so lost we had to like suicide to get back. Oh there's the interloper. I gave it a good long 10 minute wait, so we should be, should be close. Does anybody have any fun weekend plans? I actually have plans this weekend for the first time like ever since COVID. I am um, gonna go get brunch with a friend. We're gonna eat outdoors. And even that feels reckless. I know, legit plans. Can you believe it? It's weird seeing things just like render in and out. All right, son. I'm ready. But yeah, what else is going on? Not too much. Nothing planned, just gotta think of your cheat meal. Ooh. That's always a tough decision. I've just been like, I don't know. I've been eating to maintain lately, and that's been, that's been good for me. I think I needed that psychologically. Might as well get up for a minute. Put this down. Oh, no, I didn't want to open the hatch. No, that's fine. Come back. I'll go back. I just wanted to put the thing down. Thank you. Can I? Maybe I can't. Oh, I can't place it. Sun's getting pretty red. Can't always stress out about dieting and such. Yeah, it's like there was a point where 
uh, I wasn't feeling motivated anymore. And I, I decided I just needed a break. And so it's been like a month or so that I've just been kind of eating whatever I want with my previous diet in mind. And I, I think that the skills that I picked up during that, during those eating habits, like, are something that'll help influence me going forward. And that's not a strict rule that I need to live by. Oh, 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 here it is. This is kind of cool. <laughs> but what's going to happen? I like that the music just stopped. That, I think, is pretty cool. Don't take me. Oh shit, we we did it. Let's go, let's go back. We'll see if anything's there. I kind of expected this to be another one of those joke endings. There's just no stars at all. Yeah, yeah, so I, I'm, I'm trying all of the various endings aside from the, the regular one. I'm using a guide for it, though. I just, like, pulled up how to get to them and not, um... Uh, not what happens. Uh oh I'm dead. I don't need to replay the whole game to do that. So, um, Orc, the cool thing about this game is that the entire game is on a 20-minute cycle. I think it's 22 minutes. So, at every time, no matter what you're doing in the game, you only have 22 minutes before it resets. Um, you save information that you learn from each cycle, but because of that forced reset, you can, like, go to endings as many times as you want. Yeah, it's really cool. It makes it almost like a roguelite, but it's an exploration game. It works. It works really well because you'll like, in one run, you'll find something cool and you'll start exploring it and then you'll get sidetracked by something else and then later you have to go back and like finish exploring where you had been previously because 20 minutes is really not a lot of time. All right, well, that's one. One of two that I know of that we haven't seen. And I'm probably going to do the kazoo ending again because I just really liked it. So the other one... Um, we're going to go back to the Ash Twin Project again. But this time, we're going to take that little doodat and we're going to go to the... Um, Uh, gonna go to the the sixth location. Yeah, the quantum moon one. Yeah, so I think that's the last one that I haven't seen. I think. Um. Uh. 
Don't take me. Don't take me into the sun. What are you doing? Autopilot. Please. For the love of God. God damn it, autopilot. This is what I get for trusting the autopilot. All right. Game, game, are you doing okay? It's fine, it's fine. All right, all right, whatever. Is this why you won't trust auto-driving cars? I don't know, man. I trust self-driving cars more than I trust people driving cars. All right. Attempt number two. We're just gonna go to that campfire that's on the Ash Twins. We need cars on rails, no kidding. Like, unfortunately, yes. Man, the ending where you just fly away was a little anticlimactic. But I guess that's why it's more of just a, a possible answer. Maybe I'm just like too much expecting the kazoo ending always. Yeah, it's fine. It'll do. So we're just gonna give it like five minutes, I think is enough time. Also, hi, Imbolus. How are you doing? I read your message, but I didn't say hello. want to make sure that we have enough time to go through all the quantum moon stuff. I guess I have to go back to my ship to go to the other side. Eh. Excuse me. Make this one, I guess. Yeah, part of me also wants to play Lost Ember. I guess now that I know it's so short, it'll be a lot easier. But, um... I kind of want to play a more narrative game before I jump right into another exploration kind of spacey game, even though Subnautica is like underwater. You know, you know what I mean? Gotta wait for it to come all the way around. But yeah, like, this game was awesome and brain hurdy. 
and I'm ready for a game that's not brain hurdy for a minute. I wouldn't even say it was that brain hurdy. Just a little change of change of pace. Variety, spice of life, and all of that jazz. Hey, hey, planet. Hurry up. Hurry up. There we go. Then we're going to go to the sixth location. I wonder what the least amount of information someone needed to figure out how to get to the uh, that the Ash Twin project. Like, without finding it accidentally. I wonder, like, did they even need to go to the sixth location? I love this area. I think it's so cool. Warp core. We're gonna go back to our ship. And we're gonna go for that quantum moon. Which conveniently is right here. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We landed. It's fine. Do I even need to repair this? Probably not. Oh, there it goes! I remember this was a good one to get around. Yeah, I remember. We like go up this far and then we look around a little bit until we get the uh There we go. And then we go to Timber Hearth. Uh, I don't 
think that one will do it. I'm pretty sure that it's only Timber Hearth. If anyone in chat knows, feel free to backseat. Because at this point, I'm just trying to see everything. Come on. Alright, let's just try this one. Let's see if we can... Yeah, no, it's blocked. Fuck. Alright. Uh, come on. Thank you. The music has me so anxious. I'm like, we need more time. There we go. All right. Here we go. This way. All right, we are just about here. Haha. Thank you. And now, six location. Close. Nope. There we go. We did it! We are at the sixth location. Oh, interesting. Our pal's not here. Or is he just a little further up? Oh, there he is. Hey, friend. Hey, Solanum. I love this guy. He's so cool looking. I want to know what his head looks like under that mask. Silly, just like ditching the warp core here, but Hunch that this is just gonna give me the same ending that we got a minute ago where it's just you're dead. But we'll 
Let's see. Maybe not. I'm gonna wait it out anyways, because I want to know. I do wish there was a little campfire or something, though. Man, look at this mask! Little robes, too. Someone mentioned that Solanum is, um, is, is, uh, female, she, her, and I was curious if it said anything about that in here. Identify yourself. I am Solanum, Solanum, a nomai. Okay. chilling. Now we wait. to think if there's any other possible ideas, any other endings I can come up with. I don't think so. So we've seen like going to the edge of the universe. We've done the uh, double scout. The true ending. And we saw the uh, multiple people. The cloning ourselves ending. be much longer now. Maybe Solanum will say something about it. That'd be cool. That'd be really cool. We brought you a warp core! Please help us! And he's like, you idiot. Or they. He, she, they. Oh, here it, here it is. How long have you been here? Minutes? Years? You are unsure, but it seems your journey has reached its end. That's it? That's it? Ah, uh, alright. Well. I suppose that's it for Outer Wilds. I guess I, I those endings weren't quite as as exciting as I was hoping they would be. It was clearly nothing will ever compare to the kazoo ending. By far my favorite. Absolutely hysterical. Um, well, here's the question. Should I start up another game or should I save it for tomorrow? I've only been live for 45 minutes, so it seems... Seems silly. New game. GG's regardless. Yeah, alright, let's... I really want to check out Lost Ember. So, I think we should start that up. I'm gonna go on a quick BRB, and I'll, I'll launch the game. And then I'll uh, see you in a minute. 